guys. So this is going to be a how I lighten my eyebrows tutorial. Lots of you guys have been asking for this video because apparently lots of you have dark eyebrows like I do. Hold on, there's an itch right here. Okay. I still do fill them in the same exact way. I use the Anastasia, Anastasia, whatever, um, Brow Wiz in Medium Ash, and that still works for me. Um, and it works really good now because it just kind of gives this color. Um, so my brows are lighter than this, and I just fill them in to that brow ash, brown, medium ash color. I haven't filmed a video in 11 days again, so I'm struggling. <laughs> I'm just going to show you guys the step-by-step -step on what I do. I do just use the Sally Hansen Cream Bleach Kit. Um, this one is extra strength, but I have used the regular one and it's worked fine for me. But what I do know about my hair and myself is that my hair takes bleach really, really easily. I'm sorry, I'm like itchy right here. So I only leave mine on for about five minutes. Um, the box tells you to leave it on for eight to nine minutes and um, two extra minutes if your hair isn't bleaching. But like I said, mine bleaches right away in four to five minutes. So just be careful and spot check your eyebrows, kind of move the bleach out of the way and see what kind of color you've got going on under there because you don't want to come out with like orange eyebrows. So yeah, I don't think that I have anything else that I want to say. Yeah, I'm going to stop rambling. Um, it's going to be a voiceover because I just woke up in the clip that I'm about to show you. So, yeah. No makeup, a little sleepy, and me at my finest. So, if you guys want to see how I lighten, then just keep watching this video. Ooh. Ugh! Told you I just woke up. Okay. So, we're going to use our cream hair bleach kit from Sally Hansen. And first, we're going to take our pre-conditioner that comes in our little kit and just a round cotton swab. And we're going to place this on both eyebrows. Then with our little measuring cup and our activator, which is a powder form, I'm going to fill it up to about the one tablespoon mark, like so. And then we're gonna take our cream hair bleach and I'm gonna fill it up to about the one tablespoon. I do use less than they recommend, but you'll figure it out what's best for you. With the little spatula that it comes with, it just mix everything until everything is completely combined. Next, picking some up on the spatula, you're just going to want to slather it on your brows. Make sure they are fully covered, fully, all areas covered. And then this is how it should be looking and then what I do to just make sure I keep up with the time is I just open up my stopwatch on my iPhone and then set it we've got five minutes so you could dance or not you could catch up on your reading or you could just watch your cats watching you whatever floats your boat <laughs> then about halfway through I start checking my eyebrows because I can see the color through the bleach when five minutes is up, I just take a wet cotton round and go ahead and wipe off the bleach, followed by a dry cotton round. And voila, we have lighter brows. <laughs> I do like them a lot more now that they're a little lighter. Just a few shades lighter is really all that you need. Like if you're a blonde, they say that your eyebrows should be two shades darker than your hair color. And if you're a brunette, your eyebrows should be two shades lighter than your hair color. And again, I still am filling them in the same exact way. I'm not doing anything different. So I will link my eyebrow video, or I will link my eyebrow tutorial down below, um, just in case you guys want to check that out. If you haven't seen that video, I will link it, like I said, down below. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and until next time, I will talk to you guys soon. Bye!